Good day everyone. Today we will discuss mathematical induction. So the summation from i is equal to 1 to n to the expression i cubed plus 1 is equal to n squared times the quantity n plus 1 squared plus 4 and all over 4. So una natin gagawin is verification. That is n is equal to 1. So ang gagawin natin, papalitan natin lahat ng n ng 1 no? by substitution. Pero since may i tayo dito, no? papalitan din natin siya ng 1 para makita natin kung mag-equal ba siya or not. So, yan na. So, first, copy the expression. i cubed plus 1 is equal to n squared times the quantity n plus 1 squared plus 4 and all over 4. Then, 1 cubed, no? Kasi, sabi ko nga, papalitan lang natin, no? By substitution. So, 1 cubed plus 1 is equal to 1 squared, dating n squared, no? Times the quantity 1 plus 1 squared plus 4 times 1 all over 4. Then, simplify natin tong nasa left side of the equation. So, 1 cubed, that is 1 pa rin. So, 1 plus 1, that is 2. Then, 1 squared, that is 1. Then 1 plus 1, that is 2. Pero since my exponent na 2, that is 2 squared. Plus 4. Since 4 times 1, that is 4. All over 4. Then, expand natin tong 2 squared. 2 squared is 4. 4 times 1, that is 4. Then, copy nyo lang yung plus 4. No? Then, add natin tong nasa numerator. So, 4 plus 4, that is 8. Then, 8 divided by 4, that is 2. So, as you can see, nag-equal siya. So, therefore, we can say that it is true for n is equal to 1. Ngayon, dahil alam na natin yung verification, punta naman tayo sa induction hypothesis, which is n is equal to k. So, ang gagawin lang natin is, based on sa naging expression natin dito, papalitan lang natin lahat ng variable na k. So, yan. So, we, uh, we will assume that i cubed plus 1 is equal to k squared times the quantity k plus 1 squared plus 4k all over 4. So, as you can see, hindi ko pinalitan ng k yung i dahil ang sabi lang dito, yung n lang ang papalitan natin. No? So, next natin na gagawin is, Proof of induction, which is n is equal to k plus 1. So, we will prove that i cubed plus 1 plus k plus 1 cubed plus 1. So, as you can see, dito sa left side, pinalitan ko na siya ng k plus 1. No? Inexpand ko na, no? Is equal to k plus 1 squared. So, that gal galing yan dito. Sorry, dito. So, k plus 1 squared times the quantity of k plus 1 squared. So, dito siya. N plus 1 yan. Plus 1, dahil dito. Plus 4 times the quantity k plus 1 all over 4. Then kapag sinimplify natin itong nasa right side, ito siya. So prove that i cubed plus 1 plus the quantity k plus 1 cubed plus 1 is equal to k plus 1 squared times the quantity k plus 2 squared plus 4k plus 4 all over 4. Ito na yung ipoprove natin. So galing dun sa induction hypothesis natin, kukopyahin natin itong k squared times the quantity k plus 1 squared plus 4k all over 4. Then idudutong natin yung nasa left side which is yung k plus 1 cubed plus 1, no? Then, kapag nag-a-add nag tayo ng whole number, no, we all know na hinahanap natin yung LCD. Uh, in this case, ang LCD nito is 4. Then, dahil dyan, makakancel yung 4 dito. No? Then, imumultiply natin yung 4 dito. So, kapag, kapag pinawa natin yun, that is k squared times the quantity k plus 1 squared plus 4k plus 4 times k plus 1 cubed plus 1. Then, bago natin imultiply yung 4 sa loob ng parentheses, I-expand muna natin itong k plus 1 cubed plus 1. Kapag in-expand natin, ang magiging sagot ay k cubed plus 3k squared plus 3k plus 2. Then, i-multiply natin yung 4 sa loob ng expression. De so, kapag multiply natin yung 4 sa loob ng expression, that is 4k cubed plus, uh, plus 12k squared kasi 4 times k cubed, that is 4k cubed. 4 times 3k squared, that is 12k squared. 4 times 3k, that is 12k. Then, 4 times 2, that is 8. Then, since sinimplify natin yung nandito, simplify na lang natin itong k plus 1 squared. So kapag sinimplify natin, k times k, that is k squared. 1 times k, that is k, doblehen 2k. Then 1 squared, that is 1. Then after nyan, imumultiply natin itong k squared dito sa loob ng parenthesis. So k squared times k squared, that is k raised to the 4th power. Then k squared times 2k, that is 2k cubed. Then k squared times 1, that is k squared. Then we will combine like terms, no? Or similar terms. No? Pag sinimplify natin, eto na siya. So, yung k raised to the fourth, wala naman siyang like terms, so, pukopyain lang natin. Then, yung 2k cubed, tsaka yung 4k cubed, pareha sila. So, i-add natin, no? 4k cubed plus 2k cubed, that is 6k cubed. Then, yung may exponent na 2, that is k squared, tsaka yung 12 squared. So, i-add natin. 12k squared plus k squared, that is 13k squared. Then, yung 12k, i-add natin siya dito sa 4k, dahil like terms sila. So, 12k plus 4k, that is 16k. Then, yung constant natin na 8, wala naman siyang like term, so, kukopyahin lang natin siya. All over 4. So, titignan natin 
no? Kung mag equal ba siya dito sa ating uh, induction, no? Kapag nag-equal siya, so, titignan na natin. So, una, kopyahin nyo muna to. So, k plus 1 squared times the quantity k plus 2 squared plus 4k plus 4 all over 4. Expand natin ito ngayon. Pag expand natin tong k plus 1 squared, that is k squared plus 2k plus 1, no? Kasi k times k, that is k squared. k uh, times 1, that is k, double hen, 2k. Then, 1 squared, that is 1. Then, yung k plus 2 squared naman lang expand natin. So, gagawin natin. So, k squared, that is k squared pa rin. Uh, k times k, that is k squared, sorry. Then, 2k, no? 2 times k, that is 2k, double hen, 4k. Then, 2 squared, that is 4. Then, mumultiply natin isa-isa. And also, i-add na, uh, dadugtong lang natin tong 4k plus 4. Then, kapag minultiply natin, so isa-isa, tingnan nyo, dandaanin natin. So, k squared times k squared, that is k raised to the fourth. k squared times 4k, that is 4k cubed. k squared times 4, that is 4k squared. Then, ito naman 2k, mumultiply natin sa kabilang parentheses. So, 2k times k squared, that is 2k cubed. 2k times 4k, that is 8k squared. Then, 2k times 4, that is 8k. Then, yung 1 naman. So, 1 times k squared, that is k squared. 1 times 4k, that is 4k. 1 times 4, that is 4. Then, dudugtong natin itong plus 4k plus 4. Then, combine like terms again. So, simplify natin. So, k raised to the fourth. Wala siyang ka-partner. So, as is, kopyahin lang natin siya dyan. Then, yung 4k cube, ang partner niya ay yung 2k cube. So, 4k cube plus 2k cube, that is 6k cube. Then, yung may exponent naman na ito, titignan natin. So, 4k, 4K squared, 8k squared, at k squared. So, 4k squared plus 8k squared plus that is 12k squared. Plus k squared, that is 13k squared. Then, sinan naman natin yung may exponent lang na 1. So, meron tayong 8k, meron tayong 4k, at meron tayong 4k dito. So, 8k plus 4k, 12k. Plus 4k, 16k. Then, tingnan natin yung constant. So, meron tayong 4, tsaka 4. So, 4 plus 4, that is 8, all over 4. So, as you can see, nag-equal sila, no? So, therefore, no? We can say that since both steps have been validated, no, the given statement is true to all positive integers. And that's it for this video. I hope you learned something. Thank you very much for watching.